The first round was fought mainly on the feet, with Whitaker slipping and countering Duplessis strikes, landing a double leg on the South African. As the round ended, Duplessis landed a takedown of his own and remained on top of Whitaker, landing strikes which opened a cut on Whitaker at the end of the round. Early in round two, Whitaker landed heavy punches and offered a hard head kick that was partially blocked. But Duplessis didn't back down. He weathered the initial storm and waited for his chance to unleash strikes. When the time was right, he found the opening he wanted, and dropped Whitaker with a sharp right hand. Whitaker fell to a knee, and slowly returned to his feet. Duplessis then swarmed him with punches upstairs and to the body, causing Whitaker to drop down again against the fence. The referee stepped in to stop the action after Whitaker didn't improve his position, and the celebration for Duplessis was on. Duplessis landed a stiff counter cross in the second round, rocking Whitaker, before pushing the pace on the Aussie, finishing him with strikes against the cage. Extending his winning streak to eight. After the fight, middleweight champion Israel Adesanya was shown on the broadcast talking to UFC president Dana White. A moment later. Adesanya entered the cage during Duplessis' post-fight interview Joe Rogan, creating an intense moment between the two fighters.